Ladies and gentlemen, it's Tuesday. That means it's Taste Test Tuesday. Last week, we had the Snickers debacle. That brought Snickers back up to two. The name brand is tied now. Got it. Something interesting to drink. I've seen it in the store. I've never, you know, spent the two dollars to buy it, but we tried it today. Let's get into that. And then we are going to do some breakfast foods. I know we've been doing candy for the last four weeks. Let's break in some breakfast stuff. So frosted brown sugar, cinnamon, Walmart, great value, toaster pastries. Pop tarts, if you shall. Um, and enjoy hot or cold. See, it says right there. I'll explain that in a little bit. And of course, we have the Pop Tart Frosted Brown Sugar Cinnamon. So we're gonna try them both, compare them, uh, see see what we like different. And then for our drink today, we have Hostess Ding Dong flavored iced latte. So. Okay, they also have a Twinkie one. They have a Twinkie one as well. Um, so we'll try that. We'll try these. Kind of compare them. I'm just looking at the nutrition stuff on them. Um, so one serving is two pastries on both of them. Okay. 380 calories compared to 400, so that means these are better, right? Who knows? Who knows? Let's just hope and pray that... Um, these are better than the Walmart brand Snickers from last week because those were horrible. Those were horrible. If you haven't checked it out, go right up there. Check out that video and uh, see what I'm talking about because it's not good. It's not good. Uh, I still have nightmares about it. I'm joking. All right. Packaging, okay, Pop-Tarts. I, I I don't like how Pop-Tarts doesn't say what flavor it is, right? At least the Walmart brand tells you what flavor you eat. Brown sugar, cinnamon. I like that. Okay. Don't put these in the microwave uh, with the paper on them. It doesn't work out so well. So, they are metallic in nature. So um, Let us know down below what your favorite Pop-Tart is. Do you eat Pop-Tarts? Um, I think it's funny that this one says hot, eat hot or cold because... I enjoy them cold. I don't put them in a toaster. Some people put them in a toaster, microwave. I've seen people from toaster ovens. I've seen people put them in an oven. I don't know. Could you do them in an air fryer? Who knows? Somebody knows. Let me know down below. But I like them cold, straight out of the pack. There's a lot of times I'll have a box of these or a couple packs of them, whatever flavor I feel like that week, in my lunchbox because it's so easy at work. I can open one and eat it while we're doing stuff. So, very easy. All right, so we got the Walmart branded one, of course. You guys all know what a frosted Pop Tart looks like. And then we have, okay, we have the Pop Tart brand. Um, let's see, size, same exact thing. This is darker, of course. This is, you can see the holes through it a little bit more. So I'm thinking there's more frosting on this one, darker frosting as well. Um, this kind of looks like somebody licked it. This one looks like somebody put it on with a butter knife. So, let's see. Let's go Walmart first. Okay. Quite thin. Quite thin on the filling there. Okay. Not a little bit more. Not much more on the Pop-Tart brand. So, let's see what we got here. We'll take just a small piece. Make sure we get some crust, some insides, and a little frosting. Okay, okay. Good. Nice and flaky. Again, I like them cold, so I might be weird like that, but um, great cinnamon flavor on those. And the brown sugar's coming through. Um, the pastry kind of, it's got that, like, day-old bread taste to it. Kind of stale, maybe. Uh, it's the only way I can think of it, so. All right, so let's go Pop-Tart brand. But a solid, for me, 6 out of 10 on the Walmart. Hmm. Okay. All right. So the Pop-Tart crust, whatever you want to call it, the pastry. 
tastes better. It tastes better. It's got a better um, fresh taste to it. Like I said, this one kind of tastes a little stale. But, you know. Um, the weird thing about this one was the cinnamon and sugar flavor doesn't come out to me until the end. Until I'm almost swallowing it. Then I can taste it. This one hits you like a brick house. Right in your face. Um, overall, I would probably give the Pop-Tart a 7. Which is higher than the six for the Walmart. Um, price comparison, I think these were a dollar twelve a box, and these were like two forty a box. So double the price, same amount of stuff. So I could buy two boxes of this as six breakfasts or twelve breakfasts if you eat one pop tart, whatever, uh, or you know one if you eat a whole box. Hey, there's people out there. <sighs> Man, I, hmm, this one's a hard one. Can I do a tie? Can I do a tie? Um, man. Let's take a break. Let's take our drink. We'll try them again. They're they're really close. They're really close. Again, Hostess Ding Dong's iced latte. I'm not a huge iced latte fan, but we'll give it a shot. I mean, it's just cold coffee, right? Mm, yeah. Okay. So the bottle cap reminds me of baby food. Anybody else getting the baby food vibe from the cap there? Make sure you shake it apparently because it looks like it's settled out a little bit. Alright. Nice pop. Smells like cold chocolate coffee. Okay, um, <laughs> I'm gonna give it to him. It tastes like chocolate and whipped cream, like a ding dong would. <laughs> Good. Again, I've got weird taste buds. I taste a hint of banana somehow. It's like a sweet, overripe banana taste. I can't say I don't like it. I do like it. All right, ice latte. You get a eight out of ten. So. Back to the pop tarts again. Brown sugar, cinnamon sugar, great value. Uh, pop tart brand, both great piece. Gro both great. I've I made them both in the past. Um, appears to be a little bit more filling to me to the Walmart one than the pop tart. The pop tart is like right in the center. The Walmart brand is kind of more spread out. The Walmart brand, the 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 pastry is kind of stale flavored. The Pop Tart has a much better pastry, but the cinnamon sugar doesn't come out in the Pop Tart until the end, for me. Where the Walmart brand is right there in the face. I'm gonna have to give this one to Great Value. Great Value, brown cinnamon sugar to me beats a Pop Tart brown cinnamon sugar. If you disagree, awesome. If you agree, awesome. Let us know in the comments below. And thank you guys. But if you have something you would like to see us compare either tastes or smells or whatever, let us know down in the chat below. If we pick your item, we will send you something as well. So guys, as always, be just being do one good thing for everybody, and we will see you.